much, Leander. <coughs> so uh, my name is Tim Patrick, and I would like to talk a little bit about what is Heat about. Heat is a platform for beats worth spreading. It was founded by a group of students <coughs> who believe that by sharing good beats, geeks, we are able to activate even more people doing geeks. There's a lot of ideas out there to do something good, to make this world a better place. And we want to see these ideas put into action. Maybe I should start my first one. Yeah, nice. So we want to see these ideas put into action. And the question is, what can Geeks do about it? Geeks will mainly conduct two activities. One activity is going to be our online platform. This is where our community is going to be based. On this platform, our fellow Geeters will be having the opportunity to share and upload inspirational videos. Geek videos. By inspirational videos, we mean videos that make you think. Videos that make you want to do something. Or um, the, what they can do on this platform as well is that they can uh, start sharing these keys and meet each other and organize themselves to the even more keys. Our second activity is going to be that we will organize keys ourselves. What you saw in the documentary, it took us one day to organize. One day to organize 20 students via Facebook to get the new mark completely cleaned up. For the first time in my life, a policeman came up to me and didn't ask for my ID, didn't want to arrest me or any of that stuff. No, he was shaking hands with me and said, like, respects. <laughs> but you know, we don't want to stop there. By the end of this year, we want to have, on our social community, we want to have 5,000 Geeters sharing inspirational videos. Our goal is to have 1,000 inspirational videos by the end of this year on our platform. We want to create even bigger geeks, geeks with more impact than what you saw before. So the question is, what can you do to help us achieve this goal? I think one thing is pretty straightforward. We need people to spread the word of geeks. Stuff you can do is go on our Twitter, uh, follow us on Twitter, register with our video platform name, and also join our Facebook group. I mean, right now we have 435 members on our Facebook group, which is pretty nice. But tonight's challenge for you, people, is that by tomorrow we will have 500 members. <laughs> Very challenging. <laughs> so, but you can do much more than that, because you can see we want to create a real new online social community. And we need help with that. We need web designers, social community experts to help us create this community. We need proper search functions to browse easily all these inspirational videos. We need a rating system, rating videos according to their geekings, if you want to say so. And uh, we need event tools, intuitive event tools, so people can actually organize themselves and create geeks on their own. But the most important thing we need is content. That's what geek is going to live from. We set up during the break, uh, in the corner over there, a few computers, where it's just a few mouse clicks, and you will be able to upload your own inspirational videos. That is what Geeks is gonna do from. So, we will need your help to make this something real, something big. In 2008, it took 50,000 volunteers in Estonia to clean up a whole country. And this is the scale Geeks wants to go for. This is where we want to be. Thank you very much. So now we have to move over to Martin, who will talk about Q to the power N. Thank you. Thank you. So Martin, that's me. So the final initiative we want to work on with you tonight is Q to the Power N. Officially today is the last learning lab of the first pioneering course. But the course has come to mean so much to us that we want to continue it in spirit and form through a student-run organization, Q to the Power N. This somewhat mysterious name refers to 
The quest and questions that drive any development and the empowerment of a network of society shapers to it. So it is a alumni network for the students from the uh, pioneers. It is a learning platform and it is a connection between generations of society shapers. At the end of every learning lab, uh, its students will organize an event like this uh, to share with the world what has been learned and to make a step into the future. Uh, the next one will be at the end of the next semester in January of the next year. You're all invited. Uh, we want to make Q2 the Power in a home base for the pioneers, a social meeting hub where we can meet each other, uh, a place that inspires us, um, a place where we can organize um, events for ourselves and our members. Uh, because the pioneers will spread out, we also want to set up an online platform, a place where we can uh, keep in touch with each other, and a place where we can share and exchange information fast and efficiently. Fourth, we want to um, keep to the power and will serve as a recruitment agency for social design. Uh, the students from the pioneers have um, had a different, have been prepared for the working world in a different way, and on top of that, Sorry about that. They share a philosophy. <laughs> um, so that's four. And to make the picture complete, um, in, in collaboration with the uh, River uh, Foundation, River Institute, sorry about that, um, we, will make, uh, we will bring the Learning Lab to organizations uh, who want to awaken their pioneering spirit and uh, go on a learning journey with us. By being here today, by participating in this event, you, are, you, are, uh, you have become a co-author and member of Q to the Power N. We are still looking for a few things to organize ourselves and, to, um, and we were hoping that you can help us out with these. These things are a home base, a physical space to hang out, a, a place that we can study in an inspiring environment, a place where we can organize uh, a place that can host our social and learning activities. A place that doesn't close at 10 o'clock, as was often the case with the university facilities. Third, um, no, second. <laughs> um, um, if you think I would like to bring the Learning Lab into my organization, I want to volunteer as a pioneer, um, volunteer <coughs> as a pioneer, actually, uh, a pilot, um, you can join us in our corner in a minute. Then, our next learning experience uh, will be a pod walk on Theory U, what we've dis discussed in the video, in the Amsterdam Subos on the 25th of June. Uh, this will be a walk of about two hours and a discussion between two generations of pioneers on what it entails for us. You are all invited, and you can sign up at our table. Finally, if you have any thoughts that you want to share about uh, the pioneering course, about Q to the Power N, then you can also join us at our corner. Thank you all. See you in a minute. Thank you very much, Dr. Sarkov. Choose your initiative and let's get to work. Q Power N over here, heat's in the back, and hydrogen right over there. Let's go. Let's make something happen. Hello. 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 Hello.